Hey guys, this is Fury91, and I'm talking about COD and Battlefield. Now, I haven't talked about them in a while. I made this video about why COD sells more than Battlefield back in 2013, but I saw this GameSpot article, and the title of the article is Why Battlefield Can Beat Call of Duty This Year. Now, I gotta be honest, I didn't watch the whole video, but no. Here's the biggest reason I believe why Call of Duty still sells more, like, usually a lot more than Battlefield does year after year after year after year. Options, right? That's it. Options. And you, you want to know why? See, Battlefield tends to just be Battlefield. Yes, they have revealed some type of new modes, like they're introducing Hazard Zone this year, which is good, but they're taking away the campaign. See, Call of Duty, usually, like there's been exceptions, like I think it was Black Ops 3, if you got the uh, 360 version, it wouldn't have the campaign, but Call of Duty usually gives you options and that attracts more people. Why? Because some people may come. In fact, somebody commented in this article saying like they only, they say they don't play multiplayer. Basically, someone may come for the campaign, someone may come for the multiplayer, someone may come more so for Warzone, which is technically multiplayer, but it's even separate in the menus. And Spec Ops, that, that's what Modern Warfare had. See, with all these modes, you attract usually a large amount of people because plenty, I believe, just came for Warzone, especially since Warzone 3. I think a lot of people did not actually buy the full game. They just downloaded it for Warzone. And some may just come for the campaign. Some really like Spec Ops, maybe. Some really like the multiplayer, maybe. So that's what I'm saying. Call of Duty has really had this over Battlefield for a while. They have had so many modes that they appeal, I believe, to a lot of different people. And I still think that's the reason why they usually tend to sell a lot more than Battlefield does. So, you can say about how Call of Duty is more casual. That's a reason, I believe, too. Faster pace and stuff like that. That's a reason, too, I believe. And obviously because it's Call of Duty, like the name bears something. That's probably a reason, too, I believe, right? But I still think the biggest reason is that Call of Duty gives you way more options than Battlefield does. Activision, one thing they know how to do is present you with a lot of options so that a lot of people, I believe, who have different likes or different preferences when it comes to their first-person shooters come to the game, maybe for different reasons, but they tend to co still come for the game. Anyway, why do you guys think Call of Duty sells more than Battlefield? And do you agree with the title of this article that Battlefield can beat Call of Duty this year? Or do you think that Call of Duty will smoke it like it has many times, I believe, in the past? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. May God bless you all.